stay here. I'll be back. The Terminator reboot gets back on track after losing its director. Hey guys, I'm Brian Corsetti with this Deadline.com exclusive. Terminator 5 has hit some bums since Hollywood producer Megan Ellison pledged $20 million towards the project. At one point, Arnold Schwarzenegger had been attached to the film, and so was director Justin Lin. But Lin recently dropped out to direct the sixth installment of the Fast and the Furious franchise. Yeah, man, why'd you drag us halfway around the world? Because we got a job. Ellison, who's produced movies like The Master and next month's Zero Dark Thirty, has brought in her brother and fellow producer David to bring this project to the big screen. Come with me if you want to live. Part of the reason for the urgency is because a new copyright law could revert the rights back to its creator, Avatar mastermind James Cameron. And it could happen as early as 2019. Time is ticking for the producing duo who are essentially starting from scratch by looking for a screenwriter to create the conclusion to the Terminator storyline. Hasta la vista, baby. Meanwhile, Schwarzenegger continues his big post-governator return to the big screen, appearing in The Expendables 2 and next year's The Last Stand. How are you, Sheriff? <sighs> Old. He's also signed on for a sequel to his hit 80s comedy twins called Triplets. Born to be bad. Yes, we are. <laughs> no word on his status with the Terminator project, Although the 65-year-old actor told the Metro UK back in October that he was, quote, absolutely up for it. I'm Brian Corsetti. Make sure to click the arrows on either side of the screen to watch your next or previous stories. And for more movie and industry news, check out Deadline.com and subscribe to ENTV for all your entertainment news first. Hey, I'm Nolan Gould, and you're watching ENTV. Hey, I'm Rico Rodriguez from Modern Family, and you're watching ENTV. My name's Chris Pratt, and you are watching ENTV.